Tens of thousands from Orissa State are living in government-protected camps, afraid to return to their homes. Christians in New Delhi, the capital, have been protesting on behalf of their fellow believers in Orissa. We as citizens of India are, as any other religious people, are have got the same right to live peacefully in this country. There has been some response by the central government. More police have been sent to the hardest hit districts in Orissa and Karnataka. And there have been a few arrests, including several men accused in the brutal gang rape of a nun. Still, the attacks continue and Christians fear that if the central government doesn't intervene, the violence will spread to more states. I think if the violence against Christians in Orissa will not be stopped here at this juncture. I think this violence will spread all over country. Meanwhile, in Orissa, CBN's Operation Blessing is helping those who languish in the camps. The ministry is giving food, clothes and spiritual comfort to the victims. India's Christians are crying out for an end to this violence. Still, they have faith that the church will grow stronger in the midst of persecution. Through what is happening in Orissa and other parts of the country, I feel the Christianity will be strengthened because Christianity came to existence through persecutions. So where there is more persecution, it will be more vibrant. That is what I believe.